What's up, Boing Vert fans and members? Make sure you like and subscribe to get the best vertical jump enhancement content anywhere on the internet. So this article we're going to go over is called The Best Warm-Up for Vertical Jump in College-Age Athletic Men. What should you do to warm up before you want to go out for a dunk session or test your vert? We're really interested in this because we want to know what people's max verts are. And sometimes the way they warm up interferes with them getting their highest jump. So you think you have a 37 inch vert when you really have a 39 inch vert and you didn't warm up the right way. And you've probably had games, pickup games, where for some reason, whatever reason, you jumped higher than you normally do and you wonder why. Now, I'm not saying this is going to explain it, but if you're gonna go out, play with your friends, you might wanna do this even before you play a pickup game. Okay, so it's from 2005. And the authors of the study write, the purpose of this study was to determine the effectiveness of specific and non-specific warmups on the vertical jump test performed by athletic men. 29 men ages 18 to 23 in athletics, they played speed positions in football. So these are real athletes perform vertical jump tests on four separate days after completing four different warm-up protocols. The four warm-up protocols were A, sub-maximal jump warm-up, B, weighted jump warm-up, C, stretching warm-up, and D, no warm-up. The weighted jump warm-up protocol required five counter-movement jumps onto a box. A counter-movement jump is basically, when you think of jumping, it's what you do more or less. You put your arms up in the air, throw your arms behind you, and throw yourself up. Okay, so it's basically more or less just a regular jump. So again, the weighted warm-up protocol required five counter movement jumps onto a box with athletes holding dumbbells equaling 10% of their body weight. So if you're 200 pounds, you're using 20 pounds of dumbbells. The sub-maximal jump warm-up protocol required the athletes to perform five counter movement jumps at 75% intensity of their past maximum vertical jump score. So you're going three-fourths of your total height right and you can set a box to that height and jump up to it or if you don't have that you could just do you know jump jump five times about as hard as you can at 75 percent the stretching warm-up protocol required the athletes to perform 14 different stretches each held for 20 seconds the no warm-up protocol required the athletes to perform no activity prior to being tested this was a control group now what do you think worked the best we concluded, they write, that utilizing a weighted resistance warm-up would produce the greatest benefit when performing the vertical jump test. So now, when you do Boing Vert Beast, our new program coming out very soon, we looked at several studies that showed stuff like this. So we sell a weighted vest. That's why we highly recommend in the program, Boing Vert Beast, which is coming out very shortly, that you warm up every time, if you're playing a pickup game, to have some weight, some ankle weight, something with you and do some jumps, get warmed up. It will make you more explosive and more athletic. We also couple that, we've done another video on this, with ballistic stretching. So what we found, and we've tried this with athletes, is use some weighted jumps, do some ballistic stretching, it primes the muscles, it gets you ready to move in an athletic way. Go warm up, play a little bit, play a game of 21, and you'll notice in like your second game, your second pickup game, you're really gonna start jumping higher. You've probably experienced this on accident before. You stretch a little bit, you're bouncy a little bit, and then you get to the gym and you're a little bit more um, explosive, right? It's like the second game, something happens and you just feel springy. Well, we'll get into exactly why that happens, but the way you can have it more, off have it happen more often is to use weights to warm up and do some ballistic stretching. I'll link the other video below. Meantime, go to boingvert.com, the most cutting edge research for vertical jumping and the most affordable programs anywhere. If you have any questions, email us at boingvert at gmail.com. Peace.